Shane, must have been very pleasing to get a win over Collingwood on the weekend in the VFL. Yeah, we definitely were. Um, you know, the boys came into the game pretty confident. Um, you know, we did our homework on them, and yeah, look, it was a it was a really consistent court, um, you know performance over four quarters, and you know we're really happy with our game. It was a it was a really good team effort. Tell us about your own role. Thirty possessions at a very good disposal efficiency as well. Mostly playing off half back. Are you enjoying that new new role from the coach? Yeah, I am. Um, you know, Richo's been trolling me there for the last couple of weeks, and you know it's it's been working pretty well. You know, I've. Uh, you know, used my running carry off half back, and um, you know, uh, used my disposal, um, you know, to sort of help the team go forward. So, um, you look, I'm enjoying it at the moment, and um, yeah, hopefully stay there the next you know, for the rest of the year. Have you played much in defence before? Uh, I've played a little bit over the years, but um, you know, the last couple of weeks I've you know sort of been playing the whole game there. So, um, you know, it's really helping me, um, especially defensively. So, um, yeah, look, I'm really excited. Um, you know, I guess hopefully in the future to become a half backer. Aside from the obvious, where you start at the centre ball ups, how's it different to playing forward in terms of preparation throughout the week? Well, I, I guess I got to spend a lot of time with um, the you know the backline coach uh, David Teague, and um, you know go through um, you know a lot of the I guess the opponents and the, the forwards that you're going to come up um, to during the week, and um, yeah, I, I guess it's. I come game day, there's not too much. I guess you just got to beat your man and um, you know provide that running carry for the team. Tell us how you assessed your season overall, about just over halfway through now. You enjoying your time at St Kilda? Yeah, no, I'm loving it down here at Seaford. Um, couldn't have asked for a better club to be at. Um, you know, personally for myself, I'm obviously, I set pretty high standards for myself, so I'm a little bit disappointed with the way I've been going um, this year. I, I think I'm a lot better than the way I've been playing, but, um, you know, I've got, I've got myself into some really good form and um, hopefully I can finish off the year in, on a good note. Do you think the fact that you can play back, forward and in the midfield positions you well to get back into the team and make an impact once you're there? Yeah, I guess that helps a little bit. Um, you know, it's always um, handy to be, you know, versatile and be able to play in um, certain positions. So um, I guess if, there, if, a, if a position opens up in the team, then, you know, I'm, I'm happy to take it and uh, make the most of it. Just the last one, you're, you're going to be a father a bit later in the year. You must be excited about that. No, I definitely am. I'm really exciting. You know, me and my partner, um, Sarah, just announced last week that we're having a baby and yeah, it's due on Christmas Day. So um, no, very exciting and yeah, can't wait for that. Busy times. Good luck for the rest of the year. Yeah, thank you. Cheers.